Hey, what's up, guys? One of the common things you hear about YouTube via Twitter or whatever social media you're into is that the damn sub box are broken and nobody gets to see my videos. Well, that's a valid point because a lot of us, especially smaller channels, suffer from you know trying to get exposure and things on your channels. And I had a very lengthy conversation last night with a couple of guys that know a hell of a lot about YouTube. And they include Jay from Pixel Enemy, Luton, and Snoo from the Shusty Bank, and I learned something that is very elementary and most people probably already know this, but I just wanted to run through it because I tell you right now, I did not know that you could do this. So anyway, to find who you're subscribed to on YouTube, what they've uploaded, your favorite commentators, hopefully me, <laughs> have posted on YouTube, there's an easy and quick, easy way to do it that I did not know. So basically, when I jump online, my homepage is Google. There's a couple ways to access YouTube. Number one, of course, you can just simply click on YouTube, which shows your homepage and all the videos that have been uploaded very recently. So when you click show uploads only, it's only going to show the videos that were posted in the last little bit. There's only so much room here to show so many videos. So the smaller channels, will get pushed to the bottom very quickly because a lot of the bigger channels post more content more often. So a better way to do that, there are two ways to do it. You can bookmark your YouTube subscription feed page, which basically shows you all of the people you're subscribed to and all of the videos that have been uploaded in the past. Gee whiz, you can go down. Well, here it shows, well, basically a day for 24 hours. So if anything was uploaded in that day by one of your favorite YouTube commentators, you can see it right here very easily to do. So another really cool thing that I found out last night is that let's say I clicked on Pixel Enemy, who I'm subscribed to, of course, and you hover over the subscribe button. It gives you a couple options here. You can get, get an email notification from YouTube when, say, Jammin Triple Zero posts a new video or you can click on show new videos only, hide other activity from Pixel Enemy on my homepage. So essentially what they're saying here, if you don't wanna see what I like, what I comment on and things of that nature, you can click that and you will only get a notification on your homepage feed of when I upload a video. So that will maybe cut down on some of the clutter that you might see and you know the chances for to see a video when it's uploaded will be greater in my opinion. So those are a couple of cool things I learned last night and I found them really useful. I want to thank the guys for sharing that with me. I think it's a great thing. And again, I know it's very elementary. A lot of you guys probably already know this, but I didn't know it. So I thought I would share it with you because I am not naive enough to think that everybody wants to watch every single video that I post on YouTube, but I do feel sometimes that not everybody gets the opportunity to watch my videos. It's quite frustrating and because I really enjoy doing this. I just hope that you guys are seeing the content that I produce. Leave some comments in the comment section about how you find the videos you're looking for. I'd really like to hear some feedback on that. But I hope somebody finds this useful. If you do, you know, rate the video so other people can see it. So maybe they can help them find content from their favorite producers as well. That's it for me, guys. Take care. We'll chat to everybody real soon.